Houston Rockets to Wells Fargo Center tonight. Their only visit of the season. You will see them here on NBC Sports Philadelphia. Take it on the Sixers. Jumping center against Clint Capella. And we are running tonight from Wells Fargo Center. Trying to break a seven game losing streak against the visitors from H-Town. Embiid right to work here against Capella. Who fouls him right away. You can count it. Three at Detroit on Monday. He had 30 points. He is averaging just under 20. He had 32 against the Rockets in this building. But Ryan Anderson can stretch defenses out. Simmons making hard work defensively. Pulling it down in the corner. Simmons, very good. Straight up defense on hard. Bayless for three. That is Embiid, who is sixth in the NBA in rebounding, averaging 12 per game. Simmons, the bump and run with Capella. Watch the game a little bit. Now T.J. McConnell trying his hand at Harden. The untouchable, his marksmanship too good. Amir Johnson in for Embiid as Simmons, getting by everybody. Able to get a hand up. A good help defense by Amir Johnson. Redick has a man, it's Covington, didn't see him. Gets it back and it is for three. Was his cousin named Ham Hop? Uh, you know what, I don't know. First three of the game. They will take 42 threes per game. That's 50% of the shots they take per game. They'll tell you that they're all in rhythm like that one. The Achilles, something else that he's got to contend with. Boy, McConnell taking a spill. Play him a number of different ways, keeping him guessing. Covington for a three. That compliments. For four minutes to play here in the first. Bayless wide open for a three. I mean wide open. Against Tarek Black. Joel and a crowd got it done. We'll do it last year. They weren't satisfied with that. Brought in big fella Tarek Black. Harrow, one of seven people involved. Not that they're all still there, but it was the initial trade. Right, you knew they would be. Oh, my. Don't even think about no, it. No, you're going to lose something up there. Look at Hart not know. challenging Embiid. The threat, you have to address that. That all of a sudden sets up the pass or the lob. Embiid again. Last six for the Sixers to lead by seven. Black still thankful that that was a jump shot. He'll live with those. Quarter missing there. And Simmons back on the floor, setting up Justin Anderson. Who Instead, vacates and the Sixers will set it up. Anderson, another three. Got it. How about Mute, who signed a one year free agent deal with the Rockets? They move it inside to Capella. Reddick in rhythm for two. Huffington, a rather healthy three, and he drops it. Robert Beyond. And right now, the Sixers in the midst of an 11 to 2 spurt. There's Ryan Anderson. Third, he leads the Rockets with 11. He came over from New Orleans. I thought it was a huge move for this Rockets organization. Wow, look at that move. Yeah. Anticipate. Yeah. Good luck with that. Luke Baamute on. Charge switching out on Hart. And that last choice. Lord Generals always know game clock situation. McConnell nice lead on the coming to who throws it. McConnell got it. If you're Jared, you gotta go all the way to the rim for that giant killer over a guard isn't called for. Be better. He has two threes tonight. Amir Johnson back into the fray. Bayless got two. Field by Covington. Sixes with numbers among them. Bayless for three. Oh, and it, it's fielded by Covington. Not even the most charitable score would give him a deck. Again, the Rockets can tie with a three. They'll get two out of it. SportsPhiladelphia.com and the NBC Sports app. Ben Simmons, the steal and the slam. Sixers needed that. They yielded a 7-0 rocket run at the end of the second quarter. His third bucket, give him seven. Baamute quickly the other way, and wow. Anderson, it's a rather healthy three. 
Capella snuck it past Embiid. Anderson's taken nine shots tonight, seven of his three point attempts. And under with a step, dude, that's a big man move shown by JJ. TJ McConnell, who provided a real spark for the Sixers in the first half, his first second half appearance, as Reddick got it off and Johnson rolling down the floor and he missed the dunk. Flat out missed it. But look at McConnell, the steal, and helping Amir Johnson. Third. Now he escapes and does just that. And Bede against Tucker, got it done. Pay Black back and could not. And then Gordon lays it in. The 18 free throws on a normal night will see close to 50. McConnell, seven assists and six steals, and no foul called that time. But what do you know? The ball don't lie, and Simmons is going to sit to the officials now. Good switching by the Sixers. Wow. Boy Anderson. And Bede against Gordon. Had it stripped. Anderson in the scrap, picking up some loose change. So from now on, I dub thee the Fresh Prince. So be it. Joel Embiid, of course, Covington, his responsibility, Ryan Anderson, is Reddick threads too. Okay. Embiid for a three. Wow! Now four to shoot for Harden. Mm. Mm. Capella has it. Fresh 24 for the Rockets, but Gordon will try it again. Well, he and Gordon with Harden out, has to be their facilitator and their finisher. Reddick sneaking it in and he'll get it. Reddick had a rolling Amir Judge. Loose ball, who's got it? It's Gordon thinking three. Capella slams for two. Harden doesn't establish some kind of rhythm. By the way, that's his eighth turnover of this game. And B, yes! Just doing a great job trying to deny Harden the ball back. Hard nearly turned it over again. Gordon for a three. Got it. Man, he's getting away from MB. Joel will get to the point where he realizes where defenders are around him. And this one, they have it here out of the timeout. Simmons bursting to the hoop against Tucker, giving it up. It's a Reddick three, and down it goes. Reddick blowing by Harden. I'll tell you. MB has Ryan Anderson. Joel giving up the dribble. Simmons looking and floating home two. The Sixer lead at five. Harden squeezed by the Sixer defense. Owen oh, and B. No timeouts for the Rockets. They have it here. Harden against Covington. Harden giving it up. Gordon thinking three for the win. Yes. And the Rockets steal one tonight at Wells Fargo Center.